Space isn't just a flat, empty void. It's more like a flexible sheet that can stretch and bend. From Einstein's groundbreaking theories to modern quantum physics, we're uncovering fascinating ways that space itself might be folded and manipulated. Let's explore one of the most fascinating ideas in physics, the Einstein-Rosen bridge, better known as a wormhole. Think of space like a piece of paper. Now, instead of drawing a long line to get from one point to another, you could fold the paper and poke a hole through it, creating a shortcut. That's basically what a wormhole would do with space itself. Einstein and his colleague Nathan Rosen proposed this idea in 1935, suggesting that space could be bent to create a bridge between two distant points. The cool part? This bridge could theoretically let you travel vast distances in space almost instantly. While we haven't found any real wormholes yet, the math behind them actually works out in Einstein's equations. Scientists today are still debating whether stable wormholes could exist and if we could ever create or use one. Let's take a closer look at space-time, the invisible fabric that makes up our universe. Imagine a giant trampoline that stretches in all directions. When you put a heavy ball on it, the surface dips and curves. That's similar to how massive objects like stars and planets affect space-time. The sun creates a deep curve in this cosmic fabric, and Earth rolls around this curve like a marble in a bowl. This is what we call gravity. Time is woven into this fabric too. That's why we call it space-time instead of just space. The stronger the gravity in an area, the more time slows down there. This isn't just theory. GPS satellites actually have to account for this time difference to give us accurate directions on Earth. Without understanding how space and time work together, our phones wouldn't be able to tell us which turn to take next. Now let's talk about a fascinating concept that sounds like pure science fiction, the Alcubierre drive. In 1994, physicist Miguel Alcubierre proposed a wild idea. What if we could create a bubble of warped space that moves faster than light while the ship inside stays perfectly still? The concept works by squeezing space in front of the ship and expanding it behind, like a surfboard riding a wave of space-time. NASA's been seriously looking into this idea through their Advanced Propulsion Physics Laboratory. While it would need exotic matter and massive amounts of energy to work, scientists have found ways to potentially reduce these requirements. The original design would have needed more energy than exists in the universe, but newer calculations suggest it might only take the mass of a car. Though we're far from building one, this research shows how the dreams of Star Trek might not be completely impossible. Let's explore something Einstein called spooky action at a distance, quantum entanglement. When two particles become entangled, they act like they're connected by an invisible thread, no matter how far apart they are. Change something about one particle, and its partner instantly responds even if it's on the other side of the galaxy. This seems to break our understanding of space itself, since nothing should be able to communicate faster than light. Scientists have tested this with particles separated by hundreds of miles, and the connection holds true. This discovery isn't just cool science. We're using it to develop super-secure communication systems and quantum computers. Some physicists think entanglement might even suggest that space as we know it is just an illusion, with deeper connections hiding underneath what we can see. Black holes are like nature's ultimate space-bending experiments, where gravity becomes so strong that it warps space beyond our everyday understanding. At their edge, called the event horizon, space gets twisted so extremely that even light can't escape. These cosmic giants come in different sizes, from ones as small as a city that form when stars die, to supermassive ones at galaxy centers that are millions of times heavier than our sun. The space around a black hole gets so bent that time itself starts acting strange. If you watched your friend fall into one, they'd appear to slow down and freeze in time at the edge, while from their view, they'd fall right through. These space-bending properties make black holes perfect testing grounds for our theories about how space and gravity work. Here's where things get really mind-bending. String theory suggests our universe might have more dimensions than we can see. While we experience three dimensions of space plus time, 
String theory points to the possibility of up to 11 dimensions total. These extra dimensions could be folded up so tiny we can't spot them, like how a wire looks like a one-dimensional line from far away, but has a circular surface when you look closely. These hidden dimensions might explain why gravity seems weaker than other forces. It could be leaking into these other dimensions. Scientists think these extra dimensions might be curled up smaller than an atom, which is why we can't see them in our everyday lives. This theory helps explain how all the different parts of physics might fit together in one complete picture. Let's break down the math of space folding in a way that won't make your head spin. The basic idea starts with geometry we can see, like folding paper into origami. When you fold a paper crane, you're actually doing something similar to what happens in space, just much simpler. The math uses something called topology, which looks at how shapes can be bent and stretched. Think about a coffee cup and a donut. Mathematically, they're the same shape because they both have one hole. This same thinking helps us understand how space might fold. Scientists use equations that show how space can curve in different ways, similar to how we can bend a sheet of paper into different shapes. These formulas help us figure out what's possible and what isn't when it comes to bending space. While we can't fold space like a piece of paper yet, scientists are making exciting progress in understanding and working with space itself. In labs around the world, researchers are creating tiny distortions in space using powerful magnetic fields and ultra-cold temperatures. NASA and other space agencies are developing advanced propulsion systems that could one day help us better navigate through space. We're also getting better at detecting space distortions. The LIGO Observatory can measure changes in space smaller than an atom when gravitational waves pass by. Private companies like SpaceX are pushing the boundaries too, testing new engines and materials that could help us explore deeper into space. Though we're still far from Star Trek-style warp drives, each discovery brings us closer to understanding how we might one day bend space to our advantage. While bending space might sound like pure sci-fi, the research behind it is already helping us in surprising ways. The math we use to understand space folding has improved GPS technology, making your daily navigation more accurate. In medicine, scientists are using these concepts to develop better MRI machines that can see around corners in our bodies. The same ideas help create more effective satellite communications and are pushing forward quantum computing technology. Space agencies use our knowledge of curved space to plot more efficient spacecraft routes, saving fuel by using gravity to sling ships through the solar system. Even the financial sector uses similar math to analyze market patterns. These practical uses show how studying space bending isn't just about far future dreams, it's helping solve real problems today. Looking ahead, the future of space manipulation is packed with amazing possibilities. Scientists are exploring ways to create tiny artificial wormholes in labs, not big enough for travel, but perfect for testing our theories about how space works. Quantum computers might help us better understand how to bend space, while new materials could let us build spacecraft that can handle extreme space conditions. Some researchers think we might even learn to create bubbles of change space-time that could protect astronauts from radiation during long space trips. While we probably won't be folding space like a napkin anytime soon, each small step brings us closer to understanding how we might someday navigate through space in completely new ways. Thanks for joining me on this mind-bending journey through space. We've only scratched the surface of these fascinating theories. If you enjoyed learning about space manipulation, hit that like button and subscribe for more cosmic content.